This is Rafat Abdunur from Indiana University School of Medicine. And I'm excited about ASH 2018 because of several advances. Um, the story with uh, BITE, the bispecific T-cell engager, I think is very exciting. We will see some interesting data on that. Uh, there are many different bites uh, uh, being tested, and I think that's uh, a new frontier in the treatment of uh, myeloma. The other exciting stuff is the story with CAR T-cells is evolving. I think we still need to know about uh, how to use CAR T-cells, how to get a persistent response, and how to improve uh, the target uh, for these therapy. Uh, I'm also excited about uh, the fact that when we use good combination therapy early on, we can uh, improve the outcome of our patients. So I think for a newly diagnosed myeloma patient, we should be aiming for higher response rate. The Maya study, including uh, deratumumab with lenalidomide, is an excellent combination. And we will hear more about also deratumumab and carfilzomab combination. Um, so um, many exciting things. I think the most important thing is that how can we become clever enough to design the appropriate clinical trials where we our goal is to provide an excellent induction and a short duration of maintenance where our patients are moving on, cured, and think about something else besides myeloma.